Hi everybody, I'm Brian Esser from How To Automotive. Today I'm making this video on how to test washer pumps, a quick and easy way, and how this is how I do it. So what I do is locate where the bottle is and unplug the actual pump. And it, most pumps have a two wire uh, connector. So I'm gonna test at the pump to make sure that it has power and ground. If it does, then we know that the pump is uh, malfunctioning. If it doesn't have the power and ground, then we know something else in the circuit like a relay or a, uh, a fuse or the switch is bad. So what I use to test it is a fuel injector Noid light. So what I do is take one of the Noid lights here and find out which one fits best in the plug and plug it in. So I'll take the Noid light like this and I'll plug it into the connector like this. And then what I'll do is I'll operate the, uh, the switch. And if the circuit is complete, it will light up the Noid light and we'll know that the switch, the wiring, the fuses and relay in between are all in good shape and we just need to replace the pump. So if you look in the left hand corner of the fender, you can see the uh, washer pump down there. So I'm going to turn the key on and operate the windshield wa washer uh, pump and switch here. And as you can see, as I operate it, the light is uh, uh, coming on, powering up, indicating that the wiring and everything is good. And all we need to do is replace the pump on this vehicle and uh, we'll have wa windshield washers again. So this is a quick and easy way to check out windshield wiper pumps. I'll be sure to put a link in the description of the video for the annoyed lights. That way, if you guys don't have that in your collection, you can pick it up. I'm Brian Esser from How To Automotive. I'd like to thank you guys for watching my videos. Encourage you to subscribe. Invite you to head over to the howtoautomotive.com website for more valuable videos like this. Thank you again for watching.